you want to turn it up so I know you're not listening? Bad. Oh, I forgot to flip the screen on. Remember when I used to like get ready and do my makeup for videos? Like, what is that? I don't even know what that is anymore. Oh, look at that. Like, I don't even know how to put makeup on anymore. I haven't put makeup on like three weeks. Like, what is makeup? Nobody even knows. Hi guys, and welcome back to my channel. For today's video, we are going to be doing a huge Ikea haul. I feel like I'm sitting down to like have a serious conversation right now. This is so like formal, I don't like it. But Max is out there watching Twitch, so this is the space we have to work with today. And we have this nice window. So we have beautiful natural lighting and I don't have to set up my lights. What's better than that? So I have a ton of stuff around me. I'm so surprised I was able to like not get this in the frame because like, there's so much. Wow, this table is very dirty. I think I'm gonna do like a clean with me video later because like, thank God I'm like, the background is dark right now because if you could see it, it's disgusting. But for now, we are going to go through everything I got at Ikea and I feel like I'm talking so quiet because I don't want Max to hear me. I don't know why I get like, sometimes I get nervous when I film videos in front of him. We're gonna go through everything I got at Ikea. This is like weird. I don't like how like formal this is right now. Like I'm used to like sitting on the couch or something. We're gonna go through everything I got at Ikea. I spent $150 on the dot. So we're gonna go through all of that. This new Ikea, oh that's what I was saying. The new Ikea we went to was so freaking organized and so huge and it was literally like the craziest thing. Like way better than the one that I normally went to when I was back in Illinois. Um, we went to the Schaumburg one and that one is like three levels so you have to like go up escalators but this one was one level and you literally they have a path that has arrows and you walk through every single room you don't miss anything and then it takes you like where you come in you walk around the whole 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 store and then it takes you right back to check out right where you came in so it's not like we had to walk 10 miles to our car like it was just so nice i that, that was such a good one but i know that i will never go there again just because hold on i'm like not in the middle i don't think i'm ever gonna go there again though just because it was really far away it was not too hard to find but i'm just not familiar with the area so it was really far away and i just spent too much money when i go in ikea so i kind of got everything i needed or thought that i would need in the future at this trip because like i said i don't want to go again so let's just stop talking and just jump into everything i got at ikea the first thing i see right next to me are these little like trays or like silverware trays for the um uh silverware chore there we go i got two of these they were only 99 cents so like i was like what the heck even if they don't fit like i'll find something else to do with them like maybe i'll use them for makeup brushes oh my god i didn't even think about that until right now i could have gotten more and use them for makeup brushes next things i got are three spatulas because i'm pretty sure down these were like 99 cents and i was like what the heck why not we don't have any spatulas the um like silverware set we got if you watched my other home decor videos i got um silverware sets or like not silverware but like kitchenware cookware sets and none of them had spatulas in it so i just got three of these again for like a dollar each next thing i got is this 17 piece i believe i think that's what it is 17 piece tupperware set and this was only six dollars i want to say so that's not bad for how much you're getting and i'm kind of unsure of like the sizes of them because some of them seem really small and kind of useless but even for six dollars for the few big ones that you get like it's really not that big of a deal and well, it was funny because i was walking by and the um ikea worker goes bpa free so i was like you got me there i actually have no idea what bpa is so i think it's funny though that she just walked by and happened to know that random fact but again this was six dollars for like a 17 piece wait how is it 17 pieces though one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen seventeen eighteen nineteen twenty wait what one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen. Oh, see, I thought it was like seventeen with like, like you count one as like the bottom and one as the lid. So there's actually like seventeen containers. Okay, so that's a good deal. I thought it was gonna be like, like seventeen, like half bottoms and then half tops equal seventeen. If that makes any sense at all, but seventeen for six. Okay, that's actually a way better deal than I thought. I'll update you guys and let you know how these work if they're like terrible. I didn't even check if these can go in the dishwasher. Oh yeah. Dishwasher safe, microwave safe. Oh my god, so fun. I hate washing things by hand. So yeah, this is a good set. I'll keep you updated on it. The next thing is this whole bag. It's not for Meyer. They just IKEA doesn't give out bags, so I just 
I had a Meyer bag in my car. First thing I got is, that I pulled out of this bag is this like nail set, or not nails, screw set. And then it has like the little like things. I don't remember what those are called, but those things that go on the wall. And this was, I think $8. So $8 for all of these, like not bad at all like at all next thing i got are these two um like oven mitts god this tag is so long so i got on um, these two oven mitts why does this one have one oh it does it's just nicely tucked in there okay well those are coming off as you guys have kind of seen i got like some gray stuff for the kitchen so i think they were three dollars a piece the next few things are some pillowcases and they had like a whole freaking section of pillowcases and everything and i just decided to get these two um like cream white ones and then these two gray ones because we have four pillows so these were i think four dollars a piece so sixteen dollars for four pillowcases that's not bad at all considering you usually can get like a set of two maybe even just one at like a home decor store for sixteen dollars so sixteen dollars for all four of these and i already have two of the pillows like not a bad deal at all so i got um four pillowcases and then i also actually just picked up two um like of the, the pillow pillows the inserts for them because we have two of we actually have four of them here but two of them are super flat and like they've all been used they all came with the couch that we got so i just two of them are super flat and two of them are like super like puffy and like brand new almost so i'm gonna keep the two that are really nice and then toss the two that are kind of flat and these were six dollars a piece so 12 bucks for two pillows not bad next thing are these little like baby plates and i'm sure these are bpa free too because I hope they are. I don't even know what BPA is. Is BPA like a big deal? I don't even know. We got these little um, plates. I think there's six of them in here. Yeah, there's six little like rainbow plates in here. And it's honestly just for us and G. I saw them and I was like, oh cute. Jackson needs plates, right? Like not really. He uses his tray. Next few things is stuff to hang curtains. I got um, two of these packs of 10 uh, like curtain rods curtain holders i don't really know uh what to call these hopefully you can see that um but they're just like these little like hooks that like hook on to them this is exactly what i wanted though because i was gonna order hello brightness i was going to order some of these off amazon which honestly would have been a better deal than when i looked after i already bought these but on amazon they were a I think a 30 pack for $10 and I got um, like a 10 pack is $5. So I got 20 of them for $10 and I could have got 30 for 10 on Amazon, but it's not a big deal, whatever. Um, these are the exact ones I wanted. They have like the little like clips at the top so you can um, like clip them onto your curtain. So I'm actually going to DIY some curtains that I found um, on Pinterest, of course, and I'm going to do those. I'll show you guys those like later on when i do them it's not really a priority right now but i got those clips in case we do want to do the curtains soon and then because we now have those clips i just got a curtain rod and i want to say this was i don't know i think it was like five dollars or somewhere around there but it this one is a 47 to 83 inch so it can extend because then i also got um like the wall hanging kits and i think these were a dollar fifty each so three dollars for these five dollars for the curtain rod and then ten dollars for little hooks not bad to get a whole like set of everything unless i have no idea what i'm talking about and that's really expensive shoot i piled all my stuff on top of the next stuff i want to show you oh and then another thing we got um for the kitchen i actually have no idea what these really look like i mean there's like a little picture of what they look like so hopefully that's like kind of what they are but i think this was a four pack yeah there's a four pack of these like kitchen towels that just hang and i'm really into like the stripe thing right now i think they were I don't know i think they were three dollars for a four pack or something like that it was something really cheap though so and they feel pretty nice so got some kitchen towels moving on to my favorite part of this whole ikea haul and my favorite part of the whole ikea trip like you guys have no idea this is actually why i went to ikea is to get these things right here that was like my whole intent of going there in the first place because i have found these items at target and at tj maxx and at home goods and like at walmart but they just were one Target was so expensive. They were like $16. You don't even know what I'm talking about. I got these jars, like the cutest freaking jars in the world. Like, hello farmhouse, like so cute. And these were like $16 for one, for one at Target. Granted, Target does have like a set. So it's like, like a small one and then a medium one and then a large one. And like they're way more expensive because they are different sizes. Um, Ikea only has like this one size. And then when I saw that these were only $5.99 at Ikea, I 
I literally stocked up on them and again because I knew I was never gonna be going to Ikea again so I just kind of got an unnecessary amount which I totally understand now at the time I just kept throwing them in the cart and Max was like stop with the jar stop with the jar but I couldn't I knew I would never go back but I'm so excited I got them because like I said this is the whole reason I even went to Ikea so I got one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven eleven jars not the same size as this I got five of these so yeah I got five of these size um jars I'm actually gonna put like flour sugar um like popcorn kernels because you guys know how much i love my popcorn so i'm gonna put um like baking stuff in these ones and then i got two of these size ones and i think these were 3.99 so four dollars for these ones and i got two of them um i saw like someone put like pasta in them and i'm looking at it now i'm like i probably should have got a few more of these um, because I have like a bunch of different types of pasta, but I don't know. I'll, use, I'll probably use one for pasta and then find something to do with this one. I can literally put whatever I want in them. And then I also got two of these littler ones. Obviously the tops come off of all of them, but they're just like sealed shut right now. So you don't lose them in the process. But um, yeah, they all have these like really cute tops with these little like knobs on the top. I don't know. I just think they're like so cute. So I actually got... One of these strictly for um to put like sugar in next to the keurig machine oh my god why am i so hot for that but then i also got a second one i don't really know what for maybe i can use it in the bathroom or something but max was like oh my god put like lifesaver mints in here and i'm like that's the first thing you think of when you see this thing then the next little jar i got is this one and i had no idea how to use this until max showed me that you actually like push on it and then it like comes out. I think this one was $4 or somewhere around there, $3, I don't know, something like that. But I'm gonna put um, oil in this one. And then I think that'll just be super cute like on the counter. And the last jar I got is probably like my favorite one. And I, um, this one didn't come with a top. Like they all, this is like the 365 brand. Um, I didn't even say this is the, it's like Vardigan. Vardigan, it doesn't say on the bottom, but I'm pretty sure this is the Vardigan brand. Um, same with like these bigger ones and those two little small ones I got. It's all Vardigan brand. Um, this one is the IKEA 365 Plus brand. Um, so they did not come with lids. You actually had to like find the same brand lid in like the section next to it. Did you just drop something over there? No. Why did the floor just shake? I thought that too. I don't know. Are we concerned? No. I am. Why did the floor just shake? Someone in the garage? That's concerning. So yeah, anyway, I was saying that this um, 365 brand, you have to buy the jar and the lid separately. And this lid does not have a little like knob on the top like these ones do, but that's totally fine. I'm actually going to use this one as a cookie jar because I wanted a bigger one for a cookie jar. And I think this will be so cute because you see the size difference. Like this one will be for like a baking one and then this one will be for a cookie jar. Like, oh, I just think it's so cute. This is exactly what I wanted. So I'm so happy I found this one and and a lid for it and then because you can't see it actually there are um like seals inside all of them the little like jar seals so like you can close them and your stuff won't go bad and then finally the last few things i got from ikea oh these are actually little like curtain rod ends i think these were dollar fifty something like that but then i got these two little potter potter pots potter pots i don't really know what these are called but they were a dollar fifty i remember that so um annoying yeah i think i'm going to i actually have two of these which i can't grab right now but i have two bigger ones like a little bit bigger ones that i put oh my god that i put on the table right here i showed you guys them in my moving vlog when i did my like walmart haul i put them on the table and then i'm gonna put like little flowers in them but i think i'm gonna put these ones on my new desk which i have not showed you guys yet but you will see in the next upcoming vlog but i think i'm gonna put these on my desk and get um i don't really know i'm not really into like the whole like succulent thing like the green flowers or whatever those are i'm not really into those but i am into like the white flowers so i think i want to get some of those to put in here but i think those would just be really cute even if i don't use these for flowers like i can use them for like pens and pencils or something something like that so i'll find use for these and they were a dollar fifty so that is it for my ikea haul i seriously think everything i got is going to be such a good addition to the house like i'm so excited about these jars i feel like it's gonna make the kitchen look so much cuter which you would not know right now because it looks disgusting thank god you can't see it it was just a good trip i spent a lot of money but it was a good trip and it was a good trip everything i'm sure will be online um but if you do have a question like what something is let me know in the comments below and i will um, send you the link to it but yeah i don't think anything i got was more than like i don't think anything i got was more than like 
eight dollars maybe even like six. Oh my god i don't think anything i got was more than six dollars wow that's a cool title for this video everything i got at ikea under eight dollars i think the most expensive thing was this like screw set and that was eight dollars but like everything else was like six and under wow that's so cool but that is it for today's video i hope you guys enjoyed if you did be sure to give it a thumbs up subscribe sub I haven't messed that up in a long time. Be sure to give it a thumbs up, subscribe down below, and leave us any comments or questions you may have because we love hearing from you. I hate you, Max. Thank you guys so much for watching. We'll see you in the next video. Bye, guys. So I do that cool little thing I did in my video, my vlog. Oh, I can't reach. Dang it.